Hey, what's up, what's up? How you doing? Here I am again with some street noise, but <laughs> it's not bad. Uh, right now, you're looking at a Tascam DA30 MK2. <laughs> Three, let's say, brothers. And they're all kind of working. Mm -hmm. First one is actually playing the tape. And uh, hold on, I'm recording one tape here. Uh -huh. Everything is fine, cool, cool, cool. <laughs> but that's a different story. So first one is playing the tape. Uh, the second one is getting input, coaxial digital input. And the third one too. Right now you can see how brighter the the display on the those two at the top than the one at the bottom. And the one at the bottom doesn't have a knob. That would be the major difference. Uh, they're all kind of working except this one. This one is working totally fine. But uh -huh, look at that one. He's complaining. Come back again. He's complaining. Yeah, that one is... That one needs to be really serviced. <laughs> or it's gonna... It's gonna oh, look at that. <laughs> it's gonna be used for parts. Uh, you can see the display is kind of dim, which means that this model probably used to be turned on a lot of time. It doesn't mean that the head is worn out because some of the machine in production in studios, TV would be turned, uh, powered on, right? All the time, like 24 hours. So it's normal to, to display to be dim. Uh, it's still clear but it's kind of dim compared to this one. Uh, I mean, maybe this one is used more. Maybe this one is just every time they finish playback or recording, they would, you know, power it off. And then that's why the display is not them. Who knows? We'll see, we'll see. <laughs> <coughs> Pardon me, Corona. <clears throat> anyway, this one is fixed and it's good except for the scratches. As you can see, I put some black marker just just to cover it because it's ugly, but you see the, the scratches. And those two others, let's say this one, the plate is not scratched. You see, the plate is not scratched. Maybe a little bit dent, but not scratched. So maybe I'm gonna use this front panel and put it here and then someone will have a nice good looking working machine <laughs> we'll see but anyway it's um, nice to have three in a row and probably some of you who want to buy that in this time uh, should be aware of some things uh, unless the seller specified that the debt is gonna work and he or she tested it properly, uh, you will get a broken debt. <laughs> Anytime someone mentions it powers on, you know, like a open, close, that's what they tested. They didn't test it, what's gonna happen when you put the tape inside. Is it gonna play fast for a rewind? Is it skipping? Does it have distortion? All that stuff. So many would think, all right, it's, it's just probably a belt and stuff like that. Mm, could be, but most of the time this thing uh, could be like a worn out or could be, you know, someone put it in some some bad storage, let's say. It was dusty, dirty, humid, whatever. Could be a lot of damage with vintage, old, high.
hi-fi and let's say recording equipment <laughs> look at my finger um, so yeah uh, I probably gonna make one video with one unit so I would explain all those function what can you do and all those connectors at the back and basically it's really great unit and even if you have it broken even if it doesn't work as a that player recorder it still had has really great audio digital uh, da and ad converters so you can hook up like cd transport or some analog sound and convert it to digital because with this unit if you put it like in record mode okay as i did previously all right uh, so now i have input from this unit but i could have input from any other device i could simply use it as a peak meter like it looks good right put it under your computer or whatever and it's gonna it has re really large peak meters but yeah you can put a some other device on digital input you have coaxial and you have like a bunch of inputs and outputs at the back so you can use it as a <laughs> ad or da converter whatever you prefer because this machine it has really great sound that could be one of the use but yeah we'll see we'll see one will be properly restored and the other one i don't know the third one there is uh, not so not so much hope with this one but we'll see you never know you never know all right take care see you